Welcome to opening night at Nationwide Arena as the Blue Jackets get set to take on the Calgary Flames. I'm Bob McElligot, joined by Jody Shelley, and this is a night that everybody has been waiting for. Jody, when you were a player, how exciting was opening night for you? Well, it was so exciting. I mean, training camp is over, and this is a team that went into the offseason thinking about opening night this year. They want to get last year behind them, and they're fired up to show it's in the tank this year. What's your opening night like this year? Are you nervous in this <laughs> role on opening night? That's a little different, a different kind of nerves. I mean, those guys in there tonight, there's new guys, there's guys that have been here, but the nerves are still the same. It's opening night, they're excited. And I'll tell you one guy that's excited about opening night, and that's Blue Jackets defenseman James Wisniewski. The atmosphere on the, in the rink was just pure electric in you know, the last game of the year against Nashville, and hopefully we can just carry that, up, carry that over to this, this full season. And you know, we have to somehow rekindle that fire, and, and hopefully the, the fans will be right behind us. Now, Jody, you heard James Wisniewski talk about last year, and I can almost guarantee you that that will be the last time that you hear a Blue Jackets player talk about last year. Well, it's been a long summer. They ended the year on a positive note, and they've been talking about that all year, but excited to get to this point tonight so they can bury the hatchet on last year and bring it into this year. Now let's talk about tonight's opponent, the Calgary Flames. Now this is a Flames team that looks a lot different than it did last year. And it all started at the trade deadline last year when their captain, Jerome McGinley, was sent out to Pittsburgh. Then over the summer, goaltender Mika Kippersoff decided to retire. And Jody, just those two pieces changing are two pretty big pieces. Those are big pieces, but you also think of Alex Tangay's gone. He's a veteran guy that's been in this lineup. And Mike Camilleri is out with a hand injury. He's a guy that's supposed to be a veteran presence this year, not in the lineup. This team is younger, and they have no expectations, and it's dangerous. Well, that's absolutely right. And last night, this Calgary team went into Washington, and they had leads of 3 to nothing and 4-1 to one on the Capitals. They did eventually lose in a shootout 5-4, to four, but the fact of the matter is they had some good things happen. Blake Como was a member of the Calgary Flames until last year's trade deadline when he came to join the Blue Jackets. So he knows a lot of guys that are over in the other dressing room, and he says that playing a team with no expectations is playing a dangerous team. You know, I've been in that position before with New York, uh, rebuilding, and everyone kind of counts you out before the season even starts, and I think that's a big motivation for those guys in Calgary. I watched the game last night, and, you know, what I expected from uh, Bob's team, hardworking. Um, you know, we know they're going to come out and play hard tonight, and, you know, they're kind of going through a phase right now where they're, they're calling it a rebuild, and I think most people will count the team out um, before the season starts, but I think the guys in that locker room, knowing them, know what they have there. Um, you know, they still got some skill. They got some really good young prospects who came in, and they got some goaltenders that are going to want to prove themselves, and they got a lot of good players on defense. So um, I think they showed last night going into Washington, which isn't an easy place to win, to jump out to a 3 nothing lead and a uh, 4-1 lead in their home opener. Um, goes to show how tough a team they are going to be. Well, as dangerous as the Calgary Flames might be, Jody, tonight it's all about the Blue Jackets and how they defend home ice. Absolutely. I don't think it matters who the opponent is. No disrespect to the Calgary Flames, but they've been ready for game one, and it doesn't matter. These guys are fired up. Camp is over. They want to get the puck on the ice, and they're ready for it. And we're ready, too. So that is tonight's Time Warner Rink Report. I'm Bob McElligot alongside Jody Shelley. Enjoy the game.